Welcome back, Seth Bling here. I'm in the 13W36A snapshot, and I've got something cool to show you. This is a little drawing program. I'm gonna call it Paint, and basically you can step down here and select your color. So for instance, I could select this uh, magenta, and as I run around, it's gonna draw, and it's very easy to use. Just select another color, here we go. Start drawing in red, it'll overwrite whatever I've already done. Um, sometimes it's a little laggy to catch to catch you, so you might have to move slow. But uh, And sometimes I also fall through the block. <laughs> uh, but that's okay. And it's just because of how, how it works. Um, so for instance, let's see. Let me go ahead and turn to white again, and I'll just clear out everything I've drawn here. Uh, it works based on falling sand stuff using the summon command. So I'm basically using command blocks to summon a bunch of falling sand entities that are wool. They're like their block ID is that of wool, and it replaces the existing wool block when you do that uh, because I've spawned them in the same place with the time value zero. Okay, so now I've kind of cleared the board. Let me go ahead and draw something. So I'll select black, and let's see. I'm going to draw a little face. Oops. Okay, so I got that there. That there it definitely helps to have fly mode when I'm doing this let's grab some red and I'll draw a little smiley Boop -a -doo. there we go <laughs> pretty cool so if we look at the command blocks down here there is basically one row of command blocks for each pixel up here this is an 8 by 8 grid of pixels and so there are 64 rows of command blocks each row has uh, 16 colors worth of uh, command blocks and so, for instance, this is the black, uh, the black command block for the one of the corners. I don't know which one, but basically, we can see this is a test for. This is just testing if there is a player standing on top of that pixel, and it makes sure that they have a color score of 15. So, if I go ahead, scoreboard objectives set display sidebar uh, color. Okay, we can see my color, and so as I press these buttons. I get different color values. So orange is one, yellow is four, green is 13, etc. Uh, so that black one is 15. So if we come down here, this one is looking for a color score of 15. And so it tests for a player above that pixel uh, with the color score of 15. And if there is, then in fact, I might even be able to spot, mm, probably not actually, but uh, no, it wasn't that one. Let's see, maybe it's this one. No, not doesn't look like it. But uh, anyway, the the comparator is going to turn on when when the player is there with their correct color score, and then it's going to summon the falling sand. And you can see the entire command right here. It's actually pretty short. Uh, it summons it in the position where the the wool is, in the same position as the wool, the x y z coordinates, and gives it a tile ID of thirty five, which is the wool tile ID, and then a data value of fifteen, which is the color black. So each one of these has a different data value, but they have the same tile ID. And so like I said, there's just 64 of those. They're arranged into columns. I I wrote a filter to build all these things. But you could do it by hand, and it's pretty cool that you can do this stuff in vanilla Minecraft without using MC Edit or anything. Theoretically anyway. <laughs> It'd be a lot of work. But uh and there's these, just these little uh, comparator timers, comparator clocks that are driving the command blocks down here. And uh and, and the cool thing about it is when you're standing on a pixel, the comparator is gonna stay lit, so it's not gonna keep summoning new falling sand blocks and you don't need it to. So it's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm gonna give this guy some hair. Uh let's give him some light blue hair and we'll just do that. Anyway, it's a cool application I think of the new uh the new summon feature with with uh commands and command blocks. Uh, so I've uh, I've included a download where you can download this for yourself and play play with it for yourself. Try it out. Thanks for watching.